Hey guys, Trevor here, and in this video, I'm gonna show you how to fix your iPhone keyboard if it's not working. It's pretty quick and easy, so let's jump right in. There are a couple different options that you can go through to make sure your iPhone keyboard is working. We'll go through those steps. You can go through them one by one and let me know if they help and fix it. If you go through all these steps, you should be able to get your iPhone keyboard working. Now, the first and foremost thing that I would say is just hold the um, volume up and the power button and slide to power off. So just restart your iPhone. A lot of times, maybe something is frozen or there's a glitch and you just need to restart things and that'll cause the keyboard to be working again. Now, if that doesn't help, the next thing that we'll do is we'll head into settings here. Once you're in settings, you can scroll down until you find general. And we'll tap on general. And then scroll down until you find transfer or reset iPhone. And we can tap on that. And then the next thing at the very bottom, you'll see an option to reset. We'll tap reset and then tap reset keyboard dictionary. Now I can type in my password and you'll see this will delete all custom words you have typed on your keyboard, returning the dictionary to factory default settings. This is a good way to kind of reset the entire English dictionary or whatever language dictionary you have. And this a lot of times fixes that issue if your keyboard is not working. Now I'll get back out of here. If your keyboard still isn't working, you might want to head into general here and then you'll find the option for keyboard. When you're in keyboard, there are a few different things that we can look at. The first thing that we'll look at at the very top is just keyboards. We'll tap on that and you'll see the various keyboards that we want to use. A good thing that you could do is just add a random new keyboard. So let's say I want to add the English UK keyboard. So I can add that and then I can go in say into Safari and start typing something and see if it works. If it works, that's awesome. If it doesn't, we can go to the next step here. But make sure at the very bottom left, you tap on that little globe to switch. You can see the space bar switches from English UK to English US. So switch back and forth, test to see if those work. If they don't work, one of the issues could be that your screen just has some kind of maybe issues with it. The touch screen is not working very well. Make sure that you can go in other places of your screen and touch and tap. Make sure that works to tap all around the other places. You might want to just try to clean off your screen. Sometimes if there's some food or gunk on your screen, that'll cause certain keys in your keyboard to not work. Now, the last step that you can do and go through is to head into the App Store here. Once we're in the App Store, we'll hit the search icon and we'll just type in keyboard. We'll just download and install a random other keyboard um, and make sure that that works or doesn't work. If that works, then great you might need to reset your entire iPhone to back, back to factory settings because it's just a software issue. If it still doesn't work after downloading and installing this new keyboard, then potentially it's a hardware issue and you need to reach out to Apple. Hope this helps. Let us know if you have any questions in the comments below and make sure to subscribe. Thanks.